This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Greetings and salutations viewers, Voldemort back here with more 99 Nights 2. In the last episode, Zazi, our, our athletic, buxom, elven sniper hero, uh, hit the roads to help out the elven guard so that she could make her way to Tremont and help out the uh, Princess Selfie in uh, defending the castle. Now today, we'll find out if she uh, makes good her promise to get to uh, Tremont and help out the, uh, the cause. Although, I don't know why I'm saying it like this, I mean, I've, I've done the other storylines, we already know what happens, but hey, dramatic effect. Anyway, Zazi enters Tremont, holding her own against the endless enemy waves. She heads straight for the clock tower. Save the clock tower! Save it! It was struck by lightning almost 50 years ago, save, the, or 30 years ago, save the clock tower! I'm gonna say that every time clock tower appears. God dang it. Alright, just because. I like Back to the Future. And you should too. Because <laughs> you don't have an opinion. My opinion is all that matters. Because I'm on the internet. Anyway. Alright, let's head to the uh, clock tower and save the uh, save the world. I did a small amount of grinding off screen. Not too much. I just replayed like the previous level like, twice or something like that. So I could, uh. Um. Uh, not that saying that this level would uh, give me any trouble, but you know, just to uh, just to be a little ahead of uh, where the game's gonna take me, you know, just in case. Anyway, I guess we just need to keep going forward. I'll keep trying to find secrets as we will, but uh, I've noticed more and more times I've just been not caring as much about finding uh, secrets and and uh, items and stuff like that. Like I said, this is a uh, I've said before in previous episodes, this is like one of the few games ever that I've ever gotten so annoyed with. I'm just like, uh, let's get this over with. Although it's not the most annoying one. I think the one I, like the one game I just, just stopped playing pretty much was, uh, was, uh, what was it called? It was the uh, How to Train Your Dragon 2, I think it was. I just got so fed up with the game. I was just like, done. Oh, yeah. I, I basically played it as much as I could without, because I was just like, ugh. I don't think that one pissed me off. It was just like, oh, this is so bad, you know. That was how that was how I felt. Like it was just like, oh, this is not fun. I just stopped playing. Uh, oh, we got a cursor amongst us. Uh, I thought I saw a, a creature that cursed us around here, but. Uh, See it. Oh. Oh, it's on the other side, gotcha. Are we done killing everything yet? Nope. Of course not. Did I get stopped in the middle of my attack? I didn't think you could do that with the uh, Eagle Slash. No. No, yeah, you can. What am I talking about? That's how much. Aww. I walked right into that too. Why I should? There we go. Oh well. This one must be optional. Oh nice! I got a costume. Well, wasn't wasn't looking for that, but hey, I'll, I'll take it. I thought this would go off into, uh, you know, the other direction, but, uh, nope, I guess I gotta go this way. Let's get with these guys. Get a couple of kills out of the way. Alright. Uh-oh. Wait, you're a diplomat, too, Zazi? Well, there's just every- there's just- We shall attack from the north, yeah, apparently Zazie might be a uh, diplomat too. She says talking her way out, or she's trying to make a joke. Funny joke. Oh, sorry. That's from another group of people, not my own. Can't, shouldn't use it. You can reference it, but don't use it. You know what I mean? It's the uh, code of the comedian, my friend. You can repeat it and tell friends about it, but don't never say uh, never say it's original. Actually, even then, even if you think you said original, it's hard to say, yeah, I came up with that joke because someone else might come up with that joke too, and unfortunately people are very, uh, 
very uh, protective of their own material, even if you didn't, and clearly didn't know. Not that I've been, like, caught on for something like that, just, just saying. There's, you know, uh, was it uh, three billion people in the world? There's bound to be two people who come up with the same joke, you know what I mean? So. But anyway. Alright, let's get rid of some towers while we're here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, ah, you. Harpies, I hate you. I'm trying to calm down a bit more for the end of this series because because at some point it's just I, I just gotta realize that I just have to suffer the slings and arrows of the uh, harpy hordes so I can't let it get to me too much. Otherwise, I'm just gonna have a bad time for the rest of this game, you know. Are you ready to have a there bad are time? Too many. We need to put a stop to this. God. How uh, how has that line become so annoying now on the internet? And I like that game too, by the way. But now every time I hear it, I'm like, oh come on, quit quit quoting stuff like a like a, a fucking parrot. You know what I mean? Come up with your own stuff after a point. You know? Yes, it was awesome. The game was awesome. I liked it too. But you know, at some point, you just gotta let it go. Let it go. Oh, I hate that song too. Actually, I was actually not a fan of the movie. But anyway, <laughs> how could you not like the movie? I'm like, all right, I didn't hate the movie. I just didn't like it. There's a difference. But anyway, um, okay, so I guess we need to get rid of some wizards. Uh, but my dislike, but my not liking that movie stems from other things. So it's not even a, it's not even the, the the love people have for it. I don't care about that. People can love whatever they want. Mainly, it's story, really, and character design is the issue I have with it, really. So my reason, my my my, uh, my reasons for disliking something are are actually valid. Not like I hate it because it's popular. You know, that's a stupid reason. Like, I think it's not a valid reason. Yeah, you could get annoyed by the hype or something, but ah, uh, come on. Yeah. All right, let's fight them so we can get them out of my way. Ugh, centaurs. If only this game didn't have a like uh, what what is that called? Game design when you with stuff you can't walk through things. Um, I, I, I forgot the name of it, but yeah, I wish this game didn't have that, so I could actually walk through enemies. Uh, enemies. Now I know it makes it more realistic, but it's more annoying. I, really, when it comes to uh, when it comes to a game, a game should be fun before realistic. You know what I mean? I mean, I, I'll make fun of the fact that the game does like stupid shit, uh, stupid shit, but uh, stop! Oh, fuck you! Stop! God! All right, calm down. Those harpies won't beat you. You, you, they almost, they almost got me. Ugh. Uh oh. Super wizard, Mr. Wizard. Defeat the wizards. Isn't that a, isn't that a basketball team? I don't know. I don't know anything about sports. So. There we go. Did he actually drop anything or oh Where yeah? Are reinforcements? There we go. Snipe enemies. Okay, how do I do that? Uh I need to okay, here we go. I need to get up here. Uh, well let's see if I can snipe and not get distracted by uh freaking uh Is it through here? Nope. Okay, it's like... It says to snipe. Okay, here we go. Uh, okay, wrong button. Fucker. I'm trying to snipe. Stop it, you fucking asshole. Fuck you. Okay. I think they're gonna die. Wait, I can't just shoot whenever? Stand your ground, men! Push the 
Come back! Oh, did I do it? Oh, good. I mean, if I lost that, it wouldn't be that big of a deal, but it was it was a bit annoying, I'll, I'll admit. Okay, so... What do I need to do? I guess I just need to get some going. I think it's just south of this place. Is it this now? Do I need to go... Oh. I just went in through... No, I didn't. Never mind. I'm thinking of something else. Okay. Uh, so we need to go to the pot tower the long way. Let's see. Yarg! Those villagers are in trouble. They cannot defend themselves, because they are villagers. Villagers are in great danger, lady. I guess I have to help them uh, get back, or get uh, back to where they want to belong. Get back to the Actually, have they ever explained what these things are? Are they like undead? Is that what they're supposed to be? Definitely a different look at what undead, or uh, what undead people. Ah, frick you. I guess I should go back and uh, try to, uh... Alright, I'll let that mess with that while I try to uh, destroy these summoning towers. Okay. Double down. Excellent, and one more. There we go. Easy as pie. You see us Screw you. Okay. I don't have to pick up the fight. Let's see. These guys. Yeah, I don't want to skip stuff like this, but since it's part of a mission, uh, you know, why not? Okay, everyone saved. Good, great, grand. No yelling on the bus. Man, think if this game was modern and uh, uh, Zossi would be just holding just a big old sniper rifle. Now that'd be pretty cool. Weirdly enough, it's not as impressive if it's a crossbow, if it's just a big old crossbow for some I don't know why, it just doesn't seem as impressive. But it was big. if it was like, um, was her name Girl in, uh, in Devil May Cry 3? Was it, or not, was it 3? Yeah, I think it was 3. That was her name, right? Like, I'm not not being, like, pretentious. Like, her name was Girl. You know, the girl with, like, the two different colored eyes and she carried a middle sniper rifle, Hope and Dante, and, uh... Actually, I don't remember the de de uh, demon girl that helped uh, Dante. Trish? Trish? Maybe? Is there some... Oh, I was about to say, is there some mini tower around here? Because I kept seeing, you know, uh, centaurs appear. Oh, God, yeah. Alright, the other one, the other side might have a or, or uh, summoning towers too. Yep. Yeah, it's kind of weird how the game isn't actively hurting me, yet every time I get knocked around, I still get mad. Like, uh, you know, I don't know why. It's just, just a weird dude, you know? Okay, that one's done. Okay, we. Nope. This centaur seems to be causing more trouble than it's worth. Come on, Elvis Guard, you can't protect yourself better than that. There we go. Shouldn't be any more, right? Okay. Uh oh. More summoning towers. More cheap ways for the enemies to fight us. Wait. Uh, oh, arrows, right. Uh, I don't think you can get up there anyway, can you? Nope. Just have to suffer. Alright. We can do this. We got this by the ass. You have to just do this. That'll get rid of all of them. Such an awesome ability. Too bad it doesn't... Like I said, too bad it doesn't respawn on a regular basis. Oh well. I 
got to look into maybe different weapons or, uh, or items or something. How am I actually... Am I just supposed to snipe these guys? I don't know. That's... I mean... I guess, because I don't see any other way of getting over there. I can try, I guess. I thought there was a way up here from... I could be pressing the wrong freaking button. Can you actually headshot them? Huh. Uh, unfortunately, my my controller isn't um, very good. So, like, tapping it slightly does not work too well. Hopefully one shot skills them. At least on easy mode, anyway. I think it does. Okay, so I need to you guys keep coming from me. Oh, was that all I was... Thank you right. so very much. Thank God. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not a big fan of escort quests. So the whole game having a lot of these and it kind of annoying. Oh well, suck it up, you know. Suck it in. Suck it in. Hey, go. Well, that's better. <sighs> that's strange. Where are all the enemy troops? Is someone else helping us out? My lady, look. Let's help them. Yes, my lady. You know, I just noticed the jiggle physics on Zazie's breasts. Leave it to the Japanese to, to like try to perfect one thing in gaming, and that's jiggle, uh, jiggle physics. Not juggle physics, jiggle physics. That's right. I almost find it more funny than, uh, than like, I don't know if they're meaning for it to be like sexy-ish or something like that. I almost find it more comical, to tell you the truth, folks, you know, just, it's almost so ridiculous, you got to almost laugh at it. You're just like, really, dude? Physics? That's funny. But that's that's how I feel. I don't know how other people feel about it. But... Yeah, but I don't take my I don't take things too seriously. Now to the clock tower. I'm Sazi. You must be Galen. <laughs> Were you the one who recaptured the road? That's right. I got held up, but it looks like I made it in time. Inside. Yes, yes, ma'am. I mean, actually, are there any uh, secret monsters around here that I need to kill to get their accessories or anything? I don't see it. Oh, wait, does that mean Zazie's gonna have to fight that, like, uh, that lizard thing? Although, she might have a better chance because she has range. So, I might be able to snipe the creature a couple of times during the fight so I can uh, reduce the. Uh, uh, the length of the, of the boss fight, at least a bit. Okay. I don't see any gold characters of any sort, so I guess I'm fine. Now, I know I missed out on a, a treasure chest, because uh, during that area where I was saving the villagers, uh, there was a treasure chest up there, but I don't know how to get it. Oh well. It probably was an accessory, but I'll figure it out later. Well, actually, I probably won. I probably won't even care. Alright, let's go inside. I guess there's nothing else. Nothing else out there to mess with. We've come to help. You're fine now. They've all been injured. They can't walk at all. It'll be impossible to charge through while escorting all of them. Huh? They've brought Damn in reinforcements. Where is the altar in this clock tower? It's in the machine room, on the top floor. Thanks. I'll go up there and trigger the shield. Good idea. I'll come with you. Whoa, whoa, what about these guys? How am I supposed to fight with these guys slowing me down? Don't worry about uh, us. Please, uh, just save this no! girl. No, I'm taking all of you back. Look, I'm really touched by all your pretty little words, but I'll be damned if I'm going to die in a place like this. Uh, your friend's uh, quite the charmer. I thought he was with your unit. No. Who, Who are, are you? you? Uh, I'm Magni, all right. Uh, I had the Princess of Orphea herself begging on her dainty little knees for me to help her out of this mess. So you're with us. Well, what do you think? Anyway, don't you have a shield you need to put up? Uh. All right, Magni. Keep those guys at bay. <laughs> uh, 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 
Damn it. I am not gonna lose! the time waster boss I haven't seen you in forever hopefully be, being on easy mode being a little bit more powerful than game was at this point hopefully I'll be able to beat him rather quickly but we'll see how long that takes ow ah dig it out well, didn't it? At least I can see where he's going. Sort of. Oh, uh, well, never mind then. Yeah, you know, I never did figure out what these towers were actually for. Like, if they actually hurt him if he runs into them or not. Oh, well. Come on. There we go. Yeah, see, I don't know if that's hurting him or not, you know? Like, like is he supposed to run into those towers so he can, uh, you know, take all that damage? Or have to, you know? At least one more go will be all we'll need to finish him off. Got him! Haha! <laughs> Cowards. Yeah. This is our chance. We need to go to Orphea Castle now. I'll go and get a wagon ready. <laughs> Thank you. You saved all of us. Thank you so much. Here. Alright, we did it. Only 18 minutes to spare. And we got a new weapon. Uh, or that's an item. No, that's an item. Never mind. We, though we did get a new weapon as well. Let's just save that. What's that? Nice. So 50% of missions have gotten an A rank. So you could do that on easy mode, couldn't you? Alright. So let's, uh, before we finish this episode, let's see if there's any last minute, uh, scenes to, uh, to discuss. Not to discuss. Discuss. I'm going to discuss. I entered the holy mountain with Zephia as her friend and her protector, and to guide her down the right path. But my worries began to dig into me. This trip was an all-too-perfect opportunity to fulfill what I had in mind. Zazi. There's no point defeating these weaklings. There's just no point. What do you mean? Do you really think we can defeat him, the Lord of the Night? What? You... It can't be! Watch out! Zane! I mustn't let them get the Orb of Light. Zazi! What? Are you alright? 
Of course. It was nothing. This way. All right, looks like uh, Zazie once again has a uh, liver's remorse, but uh, she must continue on to help her friend, Princess Sefi, get through the trials. But we'll find out more about that next time on 99 Nights 2. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time.